Time for sleepy time. How much money do I make? Yeah! <laughs> oh, jeez, a lot. Nice. I could buy a whole lot of shit. No, seriously, I need a lot of fertilizer. Do you? Yes, I do. Oh, funny. <laughs> Alright, welcome back. Animal Cross- uh, Why do I keep wanting to say Animal Crossing? Because you do. You keep saying it's it. It's Animal Parade. Animal Parade. I'm going to go take care of the animals. <laughs> oh, letter. Farming notice. New items await you, such as a uh, various uh, vegetable seeds you need for cooking. Wheat has arrived as well. Use it to make snacks and pasta. Please come take a look, wishing to enhance your farm one step at a time. Marimba. I can get wheat in the springtime? I didn't know. Don't act like you know. It's a spring summer crop. <laughs> okay. Jeez. <laughs> You got that look about you going, everyone knew that Ken. It's well, just like, well, <laughs> yeah. Fine then, I guess, fine, in the real world. <laughs> in video game land, I don't know. Okay. Video game land has its own themes and options. But look, my cow grew up. The cow was cute. Yeah, although it was a lot cuter when it was smaller. What's it? Yeah. This is adorable little black bugger. <laughs> but you know, he's still he's still a cute cow. Although I maybe I wanted the brown cow. Maybe I wanted the brown. There we go. Animals taken care of. Feel a belch coming along too. Wonderful. There we go. I stifled it. Very good. Haha! -ha! I'm a gentleman. Not really. No. Not really. <laughs> you need to be. And better than some people. Can I get... Oh, I can't get... What? I wanted my lettuce, but I can't. Not ready yet. Nope. Also, too, I kind of messed up, and I, I forgot to time things correctly. So now... You know, I, I gotta wait until it hits 8 o'clock and then I can finally start getting more stuff. Or, uh, more seeds, so that way then I can plant more crops. And I guess if I can go ahead and get wheat seed or whatever, I guess I'll go ahead and I'll check that out. The one thing I'm happy about, though, is actually if like the plot to land turned back to where like a weed grows on it or something else the soil doesn't become terrible again that's good but yeah I'm waiting on the lettuce so that way then I can continue on with doing actual um, harvest stuff because now that I finally I went through the arduous task of going through the uh, thing of finding the animal whistle and where I was supposed to go talk to the carpenter, and then the carpenter went ahead and told me to go to the general store, and then the general store told me to go over to the accessory, and then the accessory told me to go over to the blacksmith, and then the blacksmith went ahead and just told me to go back down into the mines, and then when I went back down to the mines, the guy finally gave me the whistle. Oh, jeez. Yeah, that, that literally is what happened, actually. I'm, I'm not making a joke about it. <laughs> And it, it was kind of funny because it's like, I remember that kind of stuff. And they can get away with it too because they're an older game. Meanwhile, if you try it in, day, in this day and age, there's someone with a reviewing uh, blog or with some sort of YouTube channel that just goes, This game is shit because they made me do this. <laughs> and it's just kind of laughable at that time. <laughs> For me, it was, it was okay. <laughs> As a person who actually wants to play the games, it's fine. As a person who wants to go ahead and upload this on YouTube, you know what you can do? You can just edit that all out. Yeah, you can. There you go, you know, sunrise, sunset. <laughs> Even then, that still, that still kind of trumps the whole thing of uh, when, when people complain about that kind of stuff. Because, you know, yeah, yeah, I can see if people found it annoying. You know, but maybe that's just how they pad things out. That's how they fill it out. 
I, I'm still fine with that kind of stuff too. Heck, I would have been fine with it as well as if they also, as soon as I talked to them, they said, Hey, can you help me out with this other thing? I would have been okay with that as well. Oh. All out of water. Yeah. The thing is also, too, I now have to go ahead and find these bells. Yeah, I did already find also another bell recently. I wasn't even trying. Yeah, they went ahead and told me I gotta go to three specific locations to collect moonlight so that way the bell's fine. Now, now I gotta go ahead and find the uh, the bell uh, location to place the bell. And when I went ahead and they told me to go ask uh, the people at at the farm area where you saw like the the crotchety woman and like the grumpy man who keeps on screaming nothing will grow <laughs> I talked with them and they were just like you know you just gotta help them out you gotta give them like 10 good lettuce or buckwheat or something and then they'll help you out with that stuff once again I catch myself saying like a lot I gotta upgrade my vocabulary <laughs> It sucks. <laughs> That's your wheat? No, it's it's my uh, my fodder. Fodder? Yeah, it's my fodder for my animals. Oh. You gotta cut it so that way then they can eat it. I'm happy though that once as soon as you cut it, you don't have to take it someplace to and dump it off. Oh, and it regrows. Yeah, it regrows. Yeah. Um, it grows throughout the seasons except for uh, winter. Ooh. That's the only time it dies, so. This tiny little patch right here should be good for all my animals and then some, so no good. I'm eating mushrooms because I have no health. Yeah. If I, if I run out of energy, I pass out and then I die or I lose a day. <laughs> Eat a whole bunch of rainbow trouts that I've grilled. There you go. That's a good enough health. So I got a pile of money. I can actually go ahead and buy more fertilizer, which is good. Make the soil wonderful again. And I guess then also plant more crops and hopefully they'll all be fine. I'm really hoping though that all the lettuce that I planted right here, at least if I could get 10 good lettuce out of them, I can then finally give them to Ruth, which she's over at the farm area where I get all my seeds and stuff. And then maybe she'll tell me where the bell tower is or the bell frame is. That's the plan. I even wandered elsewhere and tried to see what I could find um, for all the other bell towers. I found, uh, I found a kid in the lighthouse. He gave me the key so now I can go down to the water caverns and maybe get some more uh, cool stuff. Maybe get some more uh, gems or wonderfuls as they're called. I miss the fact in the other Harvest Moon games they gave you actual gems. Here they're just, yeah, here they're just like yellow wonderfuls and stuff like that. Alright, all watered. Oh, well I was also heading home too, like two of the other ladies were gossiping outside and a woman wanted, uh, a one, she wanted a ten green herb as well as also a thing of wool. So, I got that. Also I met up with the frog princess. Or frog print. I, I met up. I, I met up with the witch who was a frog. Okay. Spoilers, I know. And I went to go see the wizard to find out what's going on at the witch's hut. When I went to go see her, and when I just saw the frog, I went to go see the wizard. The wizard then gave me a task to go ahead and make a potion for him or give him items for a potion, which I needed hibiscus. I needed perfect butter and I needed uh, good ground cornmeal. So evidently, some magic cornbread will bring her back from being a frog to a witch. Because okay. <laughs> it basically sounds like I'm making cornbread. 
Oh yeah. Ooh, more berries. Yeah. I'm gonna go make some jam before I go. Because also I need space. <laughs> I need space. <laughs> I don't know. Hey, let me let me just go eat. I'm gonna eat all these rainbow trouts while I'm in there too, I guess. Fish, right? <laughs> Giant fish! <laughs> Barely sustains me. Yeah. There we go. Good to go. I'm gonna need all that energy too when I'm farming. Make some jam. You know, when it comes to games like this, or games in general, where they bring food into the equation, and I'll also add this into a Skyrim, you never you never think about a balanced meal. You never you never do. No, because even with this, you know, my guy, he's just like, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go ahead and eat like five grilled fish two jars of jelly, I'm gonna have like five herbal teas, and I'm still gonna be hungry, so I'm gonna start eating all these mushrooms that I found on the ground. Okay. Meanwhile in Skyrim, you're like, I ate a whole bushel of apples, I ate three cheese wheels, I went ahead and I had also some freaking, you know, slaughterfish scales, and also some salmon that I roasted up, I also had some beef stew, and some potato soup, and I also had a big piece of horse meat from my horse that died, oh, and I'm still hungry. <laughs> it's just like, no balanced meal, no nothing like that. Sea urchins in here. Sea urchins are pretty good though. Uh, lettuce seeds. Okay, I got, I got lettuce seeds. It's good. curious about uh, if in fact I can get uh, get wheat or whatever now yeah although what what changed that all of a sudden like what what factor did I did I change to allow me to get buckwheat all of a sudden right now or get wheat in general I, I don't know maybe I did something where I got the bell or whatever if that's the case. Oh, there she is. Welcome, we've got new items in stock for you. I recommend the wheat. You can turn the wheat into flour at the watermill and the, and the windmill. Flour can be based into snacks, pastas, and other dishes. Please take a look. Yeah, honestly, it feels like since I got the bell, all of a sudden I'm able to do that. Oh, flack. Flax seeds, and there's also wheat seeds, and it regrows. See, I wanted the. That would have been great if I got it sooner, because it's it's the 19th. I could get wheat and it regrows, but now it's just it wouldn't be worth it. Oh, hyacinths, cool, and uh, pink cat flower seeds. An assortment. Oh, sp uh, spring seed mix. I don't recommend that. <laughs> Cause it gives you random random stuff. And sometimes that ain't good. Especially if you're trying to plan. Uh ooh, they got chestnut seedlings. Ooh. 
Yeah, good fertilizer. Nice. Okay. Let's see. How much can I get? I need 87. 87 good fertilizer. And there, and there goes half of my money. Here we go. Ding. <laughs> I've got a pour now. Oh, they got onions? Okay. Sure. And hyacinths are used for perfume and honey? How is that possible? Also, tulips are, uh, and its nectar is used to make honey. Delicious honey gathered from bees. How do you do the bee thing? I want bees. I wouldn't mind bees. Potato stew. I'll get a potato stew. Get a potato stew. Okay. Um, uh, all right, well. Let's do hyacinths, because I, I haven't done those. Shoot. Um... I'll do some flaxseed. Spring. Uh, nah, I'll go. I'll go turn up. Pretty much goes half of the amount of money I made. <laughs> but you gotta spend money to make money. Okay. I'm I'm half poor. <laughs> it's fine. I I did spend over like ten thousand dollars on on crops and good stuff. But hey, who knows? It might make this whole place better. But first, I need to fertilize it.
once again I have to keep progressing or waiting. I think I have to find the fire bell so that way then I can finally upgrade my watering can. Well, you can always in all the Harvest Moon games you're able to upgrade your weapons and stuff or upgrade your uh, items or tools. The way you do that is you go through the mine. When you go through the mine, you get ore. You could get iron ore, copper ore, silver ore, gold ore. And you take that stuff, and you're in the other ones, you just gave them the ore and money, and then they would go ahead and take your watering can for the day or something, and then fix it up, and then it would be a newer, better one that could either hold more water or be able to water faster. And at least all my crops are taken care of. Yeah, let me just go take care of my animal. I guess that's one good thing about having animals because uh, if you had like chickens or cows, they'd always produce something every single day. As soon as summertime rolls around, I'm definitely getting myself a chicken. That way then I can grow corn, that way then it can have feed, and then everything's all hunky-dory. No, sadly, it would be cool though if like one of the Harvest Moon games, or even if the Rune Factory games were just like, if you get an animal, you also gotta make sure you take care of them and actually clean up after them, and when you do, you get fertilizer. Yeah, well, Not only would it explain like, yeah, this is where fertilizer comes from. The chicken fertilizer. Yeah. Once again, more, more in real life than in game. Yeah. But it would be it would be interesting if in fact they did stuff like that. Our oh, little baby boar over there. I like the baby boar. He's cute. Hey, little baby boar. There you go. Whenever I visit him, I give him a little mushroom. There you go. You're so open, they're still open. Or do I not buy that stuff from them when I go buy it from the general store? I don't know. In a shop, what do you got? Nope, I get the milker from them. Okay, cool. Yeah, I get a milker. I'll also get shears just to be on the safe side. Once again, I'm like out of money. Uh, racing tips. Sure, I'll, I'll get that. Yep. Cool. Awesome. slowly running out of my food and resources that I have. Well, because I haven't been able to have time to fish because I've been taking care of my farm. So whatever food I did make, I've been using. Also, too, I basically I've I've used up all the money I had. 
But at least it was well worth it. At least the soil doesn't degrade. So I don't have to keep uh, adding more fertilizer to it. I just need some room. Okay, let's go milk my little cow. There you go, decent milk. At least I'll be able to sell something. Uh, here, I'm gonna hold on to eight of those mushrooms because I'll probably need them. For items to sell. Well, it's because you haven't harvested. Yeah. Hopefully tomorrow I'll be able to harvest more. And now that I have a milker, I can go ahead and milk my cow and be able to get milk on a daily basis. I think the turnip should be all done in the next one. Isn't it lifetime now? Yeah. I do have enough energy to maybe fish up one fish, but eh, it's okay. Let's see. Enter the life cycle. And no stamina, go accelerate. Just wait for your game stamina, use items twice and help you. Animal medicine. Also, I'll let you ride it. Go see Kane to race. Okay. Cool. I'm a, when would an animal let me ride them, though? Or be able to let me ride them? Eh. Yeah, both of my animals love me equally. Oh, well. A pretty slow day for this one. Just go to bed, take care of all my crops, and I'll just call it right here. So hey, thank you for anyone watching. Hopefully you're enjoying. Have a good one. See ya.